a call from um, a broker friend of mine. She said, I want to show you a skincare line. And I slammed the phone down on her. And she kept calling all morning because she was very persistent. And I kept putting the phone down. Because most skincare is a scam. <laughs> if you use commercial skincare, stop it. Because there's only a 1% ingredient cost. You're paying a 100% markup for the ingredients that are in there. And a lot of it is toxic. If I can give you one advice, you know, you can see in Christy, what Christy was using, she was probably using expensive skincare before, right? The top brands don't work. You need to look at new skin. And, um, um, you know, that's why I slammed down the phone on her. I didn't understand that this company was different. She came over to our flat in Hong Kong and showed my wife, uh, who'd worked for Christian Dior. She showed her a little bit about the ingredients. My wife switched immediately. Has anyone ever been in Hong Kong? Yeah, anyone else? Every day in Hong Kong is a bad hair day. It's hot, humid, and polluted. It sucks. And uh, so in two days, her skin cleared up. I couldn't care less, except that the products cost half what her Christian Dior cost. So I, the cost of having a beautiful wife went down by half. What I cared about was, what I cared about was my nutrition, because I was sick as a dog in Hong Kong. This is the time of year you should never be in Hong Kong. It's the coolest. It's not hot, humid, and it's still polluted. But the problem is that the colds and flus run rampant through here. And the first two months in Hong Kong, I had three of the worst colds I'd ever had. And I was running $5 billion for T. Rowe Price. I was running a lot of money. And you cannot be sick when, when, when the money is pouring into your fund. You really have to pay attention. And uh, they came out.